quite enjoyed Sentimental Romeo. When it comes to Warner Brothers cartoons, I'm not the biggest fan of Pepe Le Pew, but that being said, I did quite enjoy this. It's a 1951 cartoon directed by Chuck Jones with a story by Michael Maltese, and we have Mel Blanc voicing Pepe Le Pew. And this cat, or um, frequent cat who I believe is called Penelope, though at this point, uh, I'm not sure if she actually had a name. If anybody knows when the name came in, please feel free to let me know that information. But Penelope dresses herself up as a skunk because she wants the food that is going to be fed to the skunks at the zoo. And she paints her tail and disguises herself, not really accounting for the fact that there will be a male skunk in that skunk pen. And of course, that skunk is Pepe Le Pew and he does everything he can to try and romance her and woo her and generally just stalks her. And she gives as good as she gets. She tries to fight back. She doesn't just try to run away. She actually you know, resorts to violence at certain points and does everything she can to get away. Will Pepe Le Pew ever get the girl? I didn't mind it. I actually quite enjoyed it. I think one of the reasons why I generally don't like or, or don't love Pepe Le Pew cartoons is that they're very similar. They're usually Pepe Le Pew trying to get Penelope and what happens is usually pretty similar. But from the ones that I've seen, I feel like Penelope gave a better performance here. Or this female cat, as I said, I'm not sure if she's actually Penelope at this point. Um, but I really liked her. I thought that she gave a great performance. I liked how strong she appeared. I liked her, you know, cunningness. I thought she was very, very, very well done and very enjoyable as a character. It wasn't hilariously funny. I didn't think there was anything that stood out to me particularly as being entertaining. But just it gave an all round positive vibe. I liked the popcorn. I liked the popcorn. That amused me a lot. Um, so there were a few bits here and there that I liked. I'm still not in love with Pepe Le Pew cartoons, but Sentimental Romeo was pretty decent. I might watch it again eventually. Not in a hurry to watch it, though, again anytime soon. But if you haven't seen it, I think it's one that's probably worth watching at least once.